Guys, welcome back to a brand new video and another huge shout out to One Punch Man, guys. They sent me over 5,000 diamonds. What absolute legends. Um, so yeah, Mate, if you haven't downloaded this game, download it, guys. But that's ridiculous. So today, I don't have much of a plan today, actually. Um, I did do 130 summons. Yes, I pre-recorded this. I can't show you my characters. I can't give you spoilers for tomorrow's video. But... I did want to jump in because our guild were absolutely killing it. And I guess I've never particularly done a video on the guild. Um, and I've been trying to really focus up on the guild. So what I want to, what I want you guys to do, make sure you like the video, let's get 50 likes. But I want you to comment down below and, um, and obviously let me know what your techniques for your guilds are do you have special I, i'm not asking for you all your lineups and your secret techniques i'm just how do you guys tackle the guild mode because i find myself on this doing i've learned a lot of different things this i've been focusing a lot on it this week with the boss battles with the way we should be attacking um like for example it makes more sense to go right through instead of sort of taking this one out 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 so it's better to to do you know to do this then attacking these you want to leave these to the end now yes someone has dabbled in attacking there which they shouldn't really be doing but still what that means is i could probably go into fearless fort here and take these last two out which is going to open up the final wall for us so i can take these two out now nice and easy take those two out now we've cleared off an entire base like that we hit next the next people go fight stronghold and what we've got here is this team's stronghold is actually not very good so i've so that's good because i've used my really high level bots to wipe two bots out now the rest of my guild can come in and swipe out this stronghold now i want to give neil the um the shout out for this one because of course what we're doing is because we've occupied the whole thing we are getting a bit of a bonus reward here and that's obviously how you get those points up. See, victory reward, 550, occupation reward. So when you clear a whole place, you are getting a bonus reward, which I wasn't really, I familiarized myself a lot more with the guild this week than I have in the past as games come out. So I've really started to focus on the guild and I've really been enjoying it a lot more. So it's more important to go a straight line down the center and make sure that we get the occupation reward for this one. The occupation reward for this one then the occupation reward for this one. And of course, I actually don't even need to bother fighting the boss here because my guild's too good. Um, so <laughs> we've miles won this one. But of course I am gonna fight the boss. Um, and it, it's, it's very, very... And of, when I get my, um, hopefully after the uh, mystery draw event, I can get him up to five stars. So that'll give me more damage buffs, help me get towards the million. I'm currently working on getting TT to plus eight. I'm currently working on getting triple star to T30. And I'm also working on metal gunner, mini gun man, machine gun man with long black hair, coat guy. You guys know who I'm talking about because he's meant to be really good as well. But let's just bounce into this straight away and see where we're gonna be able to get to. Now, I've obviously, I know the combinations that you need but it just kind of annoys me when I wait, when I try and save up for it. Let's get a follow up. I'm not having that. I'm actually, that's disgusting. I'm not having, quit. I want to get a follow up here. Cause Jonas, he's doing me dirty here. Being that good at this game. Oh, here we go. So I need to make sure I get my bosses in correctly here to do a bigger million damage. So we're gonna get a good follow up here. Didn't get a follow up. I'm just going to go with this one anyway. Why not? Let's see what we can do. So now, okay, we need that to land on triple star. And we also want it to... Well, it doesn't really matter. So ideally, we want TT to follow up here. Yeah, use, use. Power. Power, lightning. Yeah, okay, so we've got a huge buff here onto her. Bing, bing. And she, lovely, she did good follow-ups there. So that's exactly what I wanted. So now, obviously, we're hoping that we can get some good... Follow up. Can we get that follow up? Yep. Good. Just gonna give her good damage. Good. I'm not gonna use a special yet. There's no need to. Lovely. Now, ideally, what we want is we want Empress Child to hit King. Come on, hit Lily. 
Oh, I know. I shouldn't have done that. I did that the wrong way. That was mad. Okay, that was mad. She absorbed most of that. Now Lily's got loads of buffs on her. So what I want to do now is just get it on auto. Because obviously, if, if anything happens on this one, we've got a follow-up as well. Lovely. 959. We are close. That was a fantastic one. Second place, guys. So the main takeaway I want you to take away from this video is when you're doing guild, like I said earlier, destroy the city gate, destroy one of these, and then destroy that one. That as a guild, okay, I understand we've we've done a few hits on this one, but at the end of the day, we're still going to be able to go through because normally what we try to do is go one, one, two, three, four in kind of any of those orders. You know, I, I don't think we're, I'm giving away guild secrets here, but that's what we do and we win most of them. So, you know, you better watch out when you verse our guild. Not because of me, because I'm trash at the game. Everybody else carries me. <laughs> carries me in this but I'm, I'm having a lot more fun with the um guild mode at the moment i'm really enjoying it so of course that's why at the moment i am pushing quite heavily on um no on triple staff lily so i can really bring her up to do those extra bits of damage and get to that a billion mark um i don't think i'm gonna be able to take over jones but what, what i will do actually guys let's let's have a cheeky little look here and actually go over um what how jonas did his damage because i should better see his replay and I'm, I'm quite interested with this he did it in one go he's that confident okay see I, i'm gonna get my um tt to plus eight soon as well let's have a look let's have a look and see but he's got four star genos Genos is fantastic for doing the defense down. His zombie man is going to do disgusting damage, isn't it? Yeah, he waits to use King. Lovely. Good hits from Genos. He's getting everyone. Can we get another follow-up? Got another follow-up. Now, he's going to do so much damage here. Power one up. Use Genos lower to the defense. Rain. How much damage? Not right, you need a hundred million. My goodness. That's mental. Look at the amount of buffs with that on Zombie Man. Oh, he's going to go for the whole world again. We've got another four up as well. Mad. That was so entertaining to watch. I forgot to do any commentary. So I've just, <laughs> I've just stolen Jonas's move. See, what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to rub that out. And then I'm just going to put... Um, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Guys, I just did 1.4 billion damage to the boss. Anyway, guys, I would also like to say happy birthday to Jonas. You're an absolute legend. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Everyone spam down below, happy birthday, Jonas. And I, was, I don't know what this video was. I had, I had an idea and I lost it and I started watching Jonas' replay and it's just gone down the toilet. But happy birthday, Jonas, and I'll see all of you legends in the next one.